Kenji and Darius, they're gonna work it out. Sammy and... I don't... I don't want to talk about it. I'm sorry. I don't want to talk about it before. I just want to jump in. <laughs> I'm like trying to find things to say before I start and I don't even need to say. I just need to start this and see the dinosaurs. Halfway home. That's like a whole sandwich. Who lost that? Oh. If I found one of those, I'd take it home. <gasps> no! I could have saved you! Oh my god, and the sandwich has gone too! Hey, this song kind of reminds me of that time we... You want to play Looks Like? My family used to play it on road trips. He really doesn't want to play. But it's like, what are they going to do? Sit silent the whole time? I don't think so. Your dad's halfway house is a couple miles down the road. Oh, yeah. I forgot they're stopping there first before they go after Sam and Yaz and Ben. Your dad. He's going to push your buttons. But no. not taking family advice from some kid who hasn't called his own mother in over a month. How did you know? Because he does call her. Every week. Oh. I don't even know how to resolve their problems, but I'm excited to see how the show does it. And I am happy that Kenji still has someone that he can talk to, Darius' mom. Like a parental figure. Really must have sucked him losing his dad. And I don't think they ever really mentioned his mom. You've reached Yasmina. I'm just calling to make sure you're good. Call me back so I know you're alive. I am a little worried about Yaz. I don't know if she's just avoiding Sammy or if something's really up. Like what if she was taken, kidnapped? Don't you dare throw my phone out the- Keep your eye on the road, Ben! You wanna stop here for food? This is the only place <laughs> for miles. And so help me if you try to serve me one more carob anything. <laughs> Still on with the carob. Sorry. Throw that out the window. <sighs> wow, that takes me back. <laughs> oh, wow. Come on, that is a bell. King Dino's prehistoric prehistory. You have villain eyebrows, sir. Bobby Nublar, the King Dino himself, Bobby Nublar. will be your guide. Oh, no! Not like this. <laughs> that pattern, the detail looks amazing. Only a trained professional such as myself can handle them. Hey. Yeah. Stay back. These dino dangers are just itching to break free. Yeah, to get away from you. Look how exhausted they are. Oh, oh my God, that looks so good. Keep I mean, it looks like sad. This. It's good for business. Ugh, villain eyebrows. Who dares risk petting one of these demon dinos? Free the Only dinos. Five. Oh yeah. Oh, little side mission. <laughs> He doesn't have villain eyebrows, but he is a villain. He's a con. He's scary because he kind of has like nice face. No. You look healthy. <laughs> Did you have Brooklyn killed? Whoa, we are jumping right to the point. Ride this way, ladies, and I'll be happy to show you our newest attraction. Quick. Oh, oh. I would want one of those too, but I knew I would know that I can't handle it, so I wouldn't take one on. There's like this man. I can rustle up a couple from the back. Give me two shakes to check. This guy's such a fraud. Hmm. <gasps> what does it say? I was getting worried. That I double cross you? What? No. Why would she say that? Maybe you should be worried about me. What is happening? Possible suspect. Sammy Gutierrez? Oh. oh. Okay, why, Sammy, Ben? Come on. I didn't mean. I just had to explore all possibilities. You know? I would never pick Sammy as a possibility, though. I get it, I guess. I don't know. You had to at least consider if the four of us were involved in this. Would he? For real? <laughs> you did look into the others, too, right? Oh, no, this hurts even more. Because he didn't. Does it really matter? He might have looked into, like, Kenji. You're the only one I couldn't rule out right away. Like you said, you did spy before. I do trust you. Now. Now? Oh, wow. I was just as shocked to hear about Brooklyn's death as you were, son. I doubt that. <laughs> I'm gonna go stand over here. <laughs>
Oh, I've been at this halfway house for nearly a year. That doesn't mean you could have, couldn't have hired someone or worked out some deal. I was in prison for five years before that. I couldn't have had anything to do with your girlfriend's death. That's not true. You're not the only one who knows things. This is family business. No, you- Fine. What about camp fam? <laughs> what? Clearly we're eavesdropping. Sit down or go away. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> you still haven't answered our questions. So it really takes some effort. It's go. What does she go? Don't do the Japanese thing. I have no time for his dad. I'm on Kenji's side right now. I just have no time for his dad. We need to find out what happened at Brooklyn and go do more important things, which is not be here with his dad. I am proud. Just never had a father around to practice with. Because I was busy building a legacy. He's your legacy. I've got some things in motion that will bring honor back to our name. You've got things in motion? If you got things in motion, I'm pretty sure you could put in motion that you want Brooklyn dead. I don't trust him. No, not this again. I already told you, I don't want anything to do with your hidden money or your business. When you and your friends took down Manticore, my face was all over the news. Your fault. Yeah, okay, I'll get my <laughs> violin. My <laughs> face might be disgraced. But yours isn't. Yours is the face of a survivor. I'll tell you everything I know about Brooklyn if you join my new company as CEO. This is why he's a shitty dad. Because even if Kenji's like, I will never speak to you again for the rest of my life, as a father, should still tell him everything he knows about Brooklyn, even if that's the last time they ever speak. If he really loved him, it wouldn't matter if he's in his life or not. He'd just want to give his son anything he could. And that's what his son wants. But he's like, nah, I want to use your face to start my new business. <sighs> his dad sucks. <laughs> oh no. I mean, I'm not mad that they're taking down this guy's business because he sucks. <laughs> Kick him in the butt. Oh no! Oh my gosh. Go on. Just run away from it. That probably like, broke his spine. Just hit him in the back. That man is paralyzed. <laughs> Looks like Bobby's gonna need to find another attraction. Dude, Bobby is about to die. His spinal cord is severed. <laughs> oh, score! Oh my God, I love her. You totally <laughs> saved my butt back there. Your name's also on my list of loyal and amazing friends. We've got a problem. My back. Oh, my back. Everything always has to be like a, a, a transaction with him. Done yes. by his rules, on his terms. Yeah, yeah. Yes, Darius. You just let him vent and you throw in your yes occasionally. Uh, yes, yes, exactly. Yes. This could be good for them. You can either sell your soul to me or never know what was going on with Brooklyn. What a monster. That sucks so bad for Kenji. What would you do? Don't want you to have to sacrifice the man you're becoming just to make peace with the guy who's never treated you right. It's not even about peace, so it's about the information on Brooklyn. But if we want to find out why Brooklyn was here... Yeah, your dad's such a piece of shit. You agree to my terms? Obviously, my only option. Excellent. He loved Brooklyn more than this man loved his own son. <laughs> you can just give a few speeches a year to our shareholders. It'll be easy. I know how you like things easy. You don't know your son anymore, clearly. Easy? What part of this is easy? What part about Kenji's life has been easy? On an island full of dinosaurs? Even before that, his dad abandoned them. No, I'm not gonna do it. I won't let you control me. You're not serious. I don't need you. Goodbye, dad. I'll tell you about Brooklyn. You're still a piece of shit? But you're trying. She came to see me about dinosaurs being where they shouldn't, buying, selling, the like. She wanted to get into the game. Her exact words were, I'm not afraid to get my hands dirty. Brooklyn would never say that. Look, son. She might, if she's trying to find a bigger fish to take down, she might be pretending to be one of those to take down someone worse. I just didn't think she'd be foolish enough to get herself killed. Listen. I don't hear anything. 
what should we be hearing? Oh, no birds. You should go inside. <gasps> Raptors? Oh my gosh, is Kenji's dad gonna get killed right now? Oh, the guard! Oh, poor guard. I love the one with red eyes. They're making themselves known? Whoa, you are a freaking terrifying doll. Wow, look at the detail on her skin. Oh, Kenji's dad's gonna wrestle the raptor! His dad just got eight! No. She's scary. They made her look scary like a doll. Uh, uh, Come on, Kenji, you're you a rock climber. Get it together. Oh, wait, never mind. He saw his dad get killed. Who is this? Get in! Okay. Oh, you're. Stop! Blink! They made her not blink at all. Oh, there we go. One blink. It seems like Darius and Kenji are now on talking terms. I don't think their relationship is fully repaired yet. Wanna say I feel bad about Kenji's dad dying, but I don't. I feel bad about what it will do to Kenji, him having seen it and him having now like actually lost a father. Unless like for some reason, you know, Kenji's dad didn't get killed by them. But right now I'm operating off the information that I think his dad is dead. It sucks what that's gonna do to Kenji, but Mr. Khan, you sucked. Like you sucked so bad at every chance you got, you took the suck option, except right at the end. And that's when I kind of knew you were gonna die. So I almost wish, I don't know, like you either die just a villain or you don't die yet. It's just so classic, I guess. A person becomes good right before they die. And it's supposed to make you feel bad for them, but this, I don't feel bad for him at all. I like that Sammy and Ben just had a little field trip side quest, but it seems like it's leading to something because that guy called in. He's like, we have a problem. What does he mean by problem? Is it just that someone let out his dinosaurs or specifically these kids? I don't know if he's more involved. I feel like we're not done seeing him yet. Um, the doll girl? No, she's creepy. She doesn't blink. That's, there's not much to her. So I don't really have much to go on. Didn't make her likable <laughs> from what we've seen so far. She's hunting young adults. Seems kind of not cool. We're gonna jump into the next one. Oh, we just jumped into some random man's car. Usually, that's always never a good idea. But this time it was that or death. I mean, this could be death too. She is suffering severe PTSD from these dinosaurs. Oh, Steggy? <laughs> that was amazing. 14 months ago, okay. I feel like I'm gonna cry every time I see Brooklyn on screen. Yaz is being too hard on herself, isn't she? I really like Yaz's design. I thought I was done with dinosaurs once we left the island, but then they go and follow me back here. Why is it so hard again? Maybe because now you know you can't actually escape? Not that I don't love hanging out with you. Any particular reason I'm here and not Sammy? <sighs> Sammy still treats me like a fragile flower. This new college program in Wyoming will be good for the two of us. She'll see the progress I'm making once I'm there. <sighs> Ah, uh, you can't keep dodging her calls. I'm glad she's okay though, since we just saw her in the present and she's not kidnapped. Oh, Eyes on the road, Ben! Oh my gosh! Yes? Yes, me <laughs> Oh my gosh. If they weren't driving, I would punch that kid in the throat. <laughs> yes, Mina is actually on the phone. Why is- Okay, I was say, why is he doing this? He knows we're actually being hunted. Ben? 
as in Ben Pincus. His last name is Pincus? <laughs> that's, that's awesome. What's the occasion? <sighs> Death. I can explain more in person. Just stay where you are and we'll be there to get you. Love you. Love you too. You didn't want to tell Yaz what's going on? Maybe not over the phone. I don't know. All those dinosaurs you've been traumatized by. Well, guess what? They're coming for you. Remember how she got when the dinosaurs made it to the mainland? We haven't really talked much lately. I wish we had more flashbacks. She acts like everything's good. I can tell she's still struggling. Yaz just needs me to help her through it. Sammy is sometimes overbearing when she's trying to help people. Like when she was trying to help Yaz come out of her shell. It did work, but she was laying on a little strong. I knew this was a protected island. After everything we've seen, over the top doesn't <laughs> seem so bad. Oh, wow. Wow, there's an actual dinosaur free zone. I'm sure it's not the only one. There's probably a whole, like, I don't think that, is this just a college or is this like a whole town? <laughs> so this place is really dinosaur free like no dinosaurs <laughs> bring it in fadula i was thinking i gotta take you to little eat they gotta go we really need to get going but you just got here all of us you have to tell her what's going on dangerous people looking for us kenji yeah. and darius too the camp fam is in danger if we're in danger, we shouldn't leave. No. It does seem like a safe place, only from dinosaurs, but it's not a safe place from people. What could be safer than an island designed to keep danger out? I'll show you what I mean. I'm not surprised she wants to stay there. This is what she thought the world was going to be when she came back. But now there's dinosaurs everywhere. We actually help people learn how to work through their trauma so they can reintegrate with society. How can you possibly guarantee no dinosaurs make it over? I'm just mostly wondering about the airspace. How do they keep the airspace clear? We even have a radar system to detect and deter any reptiles of the flying variety. Okay. West Indian lilac. Dinosaurs get sick. Remember that from the first movie. Isn't this just building a false sense of security? I have something to show you. Ta-da! It's a big gazebo. <laughs> I mean, a little warning would have been nice, but I like to hear him scream. <laughs> oh, so now this is like their therapy. They can, I don't know. I liked her other dinosaur therapy better. I am so sorry. This is the project I told you about. It's a form of immersion therapy. He didn't even flinch. <laughs> right? I think it's really good as an early step, but then you do have to, you know, move on to seeing real dinosaurs and then getting back out into the world. This might be the perfect place to keep us safe from danger. Are you kidding me? But what about the people part of the danger? They're going to keep us safe from this. This is annoying. Stop treating her like she's stupid. Let's just get on the road. Someone is hunting Or us. tell her now. Man. Yes. And whoever it is, they're using dinosaurs to do it. I want to know everything you know. Brooklyn's death was not an accident. Why didn't you tell me? What more can I do to prove to you that I am not the fragile person you think I am? Well, how could I? You barely called or texted. Oh, that is true. You move away and leave me behind with hardly a word from you at all. You blame me for not knowing how much you've grown? Yeah. I, no matter what I do, you still treat me like a child instead of your girlfriend. It seems like both of you are having some communication problems, but I'm glad we're getting it out. I'm out of here. Do I go after her? I really think you guys should all stick together. Relationships are difficult. Talking about feelings is <laughs> difficult. When me and my girlfriend... I'm sorry, girlfriend? <sighs> Why does everyone act so surprised when I say that? She's the girlfriend that goes to a different school. You don't know her. Do we think she's real? You and Sammy, you got a good thing going. I mean, maybe he does have a girlfriend and we'll meet her. Are there other immersion stations on the island? Someone's screaming. <gasps> there. What is that, Finn? Little Finn boy. You're kind of chunky. Kind of like... 
wide this way instead of this way? <laughs> what kind of dinosaur is this? I don't know. So somebody was able to get onto this island, shut down all of their detec detectors. Oh my! Did it just throw up in the air and eat him, or did it just throw him across the place? No, I don't think it threw him. I think it just ate, threw him up in the air and ate him. There's a lot of implied death in this one. Huh? Oh, jeez! How? Good coloring! I love the coloring on like, every dinosaur we've seen so far. It looks so unique. I just like that they're not all like a green or a gray. Is that dinosaur from Haircut Girl too? Yeah, the gate's closed, right? Or is there another dinosaur? They- there is people that really want these children dead. Well, what do we do? Ram it! DPW. Those are the bad guys. Wait, are they? I don't know. I don't know if we're safe. Okay. <gasps> They're not our friends! They are bad guys! Ram all of them! Kill them all! I guess you can try to swerve around the dinosaurs, but we need to run these people down. <gasps> what is holding us up on the road right now? What is holding this van up? say about this though i assume the kids they're not dead but they just ran them down which means they have no vehicle i i just don't know how all three of them are gonna get away how are they gonna swim away i feel like they're gonna get caught right now by the dpw i guess though if they do get caught i still think brooklyn's alive so if they do get caught maybe they'll take these kids to wherever brooklyn is because i'm pretty i don't know i feel like she's kidnapped and they're holding her somewhere i don't know why i don't know why they would kidnap her to hold her somewhere for this long of a period but i just don't want her to be dead we're jumping into episode seven i like the idea that they're using dinosaurs to hunt these children because it's harder to trace back to a human i think that is extremely dark but I, that night they're still in the van oh my gosh they're underwater right now sammy is it under the jeep can it not swim oh my gosh i don't want the dinosaur to drown Okay. Hey, hey, you're okay, Sammy. I couldn't tell if the dinosaur was drowning or if it is out there swimming around. And is that what just hit their vehicle again? <sighs> Thanks for for saving us back there, sir. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's, it's the least, least I can do. <laughs> Kenji. His dad just died in front of him. Kenji. <laughs> Oh no! Oh no! Poor Kenji! Don't cry, cause I'm gonna cry. Of course he's not. Dude, pull over now! No, no, there's not a snowball's chance. Did I mention to you what just happened to that guy? That is horrible, horrifying to see a parent die, even if they are shitty like his dad. Is he okay? No. That guy was his father. He, he's gone. Oh, he's gone. <laughs> And that just takes away any chance for Mr. Khan to get better for Kenji because he's gone. <gasps> Poor Kenji! Oh man! If we don't want to end up like that guy, you're uh... Let's just get in the- let's get back in the car. You- you were there the night Brooklyn died. What? Oh? Wait, 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 hey, hey! <gasps> okay. Are we next on your list? I have nothing to do with your dad's death. We have to go. In Brooklyn? We, I know, we have to go now, though. I, I can tell you what happened. It wasn't rogue. It was, it was there on purpose. But hello, you just saw how those raptors responded to that woman back there. It's not that hard to think it's not a rogue Allosaurus. 
Thank you. Out of all the stuff that the Nublar Six have been through, I'm surprised at the fact that they're being hunted by dinosaurs that are being controlled by humans. I'm surprised that's the thing that they're like, nah, can't be. But maybe a part of it is like, they just want it so bad to not be that, that they're just rejecting the idea. At least at first. what happened at night. My job was to transport dinosaurs from point A to point B. Someone from the DPW reached out, said I could make a little overtime, take a tranked dinosaur to a random spot, offload it to a waiting unmarked truck. Extra cash shows up in my next paycheck. At the time I thought, what's the real harm? I can save for Haraya's college. Oh, until someone did get hurt. No other truck showed up. The dino definitely wasn't sedated like they usually are. Don't you have a trank gun? Just sedate it. Get back in your vehicle. That's when it happened. Run! Back to your truck, sir! He wasn't supposed to survive this, though, I don't think. Can it smell you? The Allosaurus walks a little weird. <laughs> so you survived because she died? If you want to watch this and other shows and movies unedited full length, they're over on my Patreon. You can go watch them. Want to pick a movie for me to watch? Want to vote and post decide what I watch next and watch some requested movies with me? You can do that. I waited a long time in those bushes. I'm surprised he went and looked and didn't just get back in his truck and leave. He's kind of brave for going to look. <laughs> Don't touch it! Hey! Have you seen my friend? She... <sighs> oh, it's... So he found her phone and there was blood. I still don't think she's dead. She might have got hurt, but I don't think she's dead. I panicked when the police came. They figured I was called in to capture the dino. Job well done. I didn't mean for anyone to get hurt. For your friend to- I'm sure he's not the only driver that has done this, taking these little extra jobs. I wonder how many other people in this world have gotten killed by dinosaur just as a way to assassinate somebody. Haraya helped me find you. I know this doesn't fix what happened, but someone should have this. Someone who cared about her. You were great down there. I guess we need each other. Ben, you doing okay? <laughs> Oh, he lost his van. That was like his home. He literally lived in that. Baby. <gasps> oh, poor guy. Ciao. All she said was that she had something to show me. What? Oh. I, I thought it was... Let me try. Uh... What was it? 239. Here. Home? Wait. Brooklyn had a place here? What? No, she didn't. Well, she had a place she frequented enough to label it home. You didn't know your friend had a house here? That's messed up. We don't need input from you. They're still up there. Come on. Keep it steady, man. All the Nublar kids had to leave their homes in a hurry to where none of them have extra clothes. So they will be in the same clothes this whole entire season. They do already think they got rid of us. They won't suspect a thing. Oh, oh. Come on, let's get these things on the road. The map says this is the place. This is it for me, fellas. I should have never got caught up in this in the first place. Go home to your daughter. Good luck. You go home to your daughter and you take legit jobs from now. Ready to see what's up there? I think they're gonna find like this crazy evidence of some other thing, some other like big black market ring that she was trying to unearth so she could stop it. Sammy, I'm glad you're okay. You'll never guess what- Oh, I forgot they won't be able to communicate anymore at all. 
Look, there's something going on within the DPW. Someone from there might be the ones chasing us. Be careful. Very careful. Oh, they already know. Don't worry, Darius. DPW press releases from Dudley Cabrera's office? See, she's been investigating the DPW. Why would she have these? What is this? Dino tracker. Tracking the location of a bunch of DPW dinosaurs. Asset 12 en route to drop point ETA midnight tomorrow. It's so cold in here. Always leaving these in the middle of the floor. It was so annoying. I, I was so afraid I was gonna break your neck. Did she do that when she was staying with you after we broke up? <laughs> I swear, she did it just to annoy us. <laughs> Good. Mateo was doing an off the books transfer. Is someone from the DPW selling dinosaurs? You gotta come see this. I wonder what he found. What is that? Oh, a bag full of I found money. This inside. DK? Donkey Kong. As in Daniel Kahn? Oh, same it's thing. My dad's handwriting. This was his legacy. My dad was buying dinosaurs in Brooklyn. She was helping him do it. I don't know if she was helping. You don't believe that. It makes sense. We should go to that drop. Maybe we can find out who from the DPW is selling dinosaurs. Or what else she was hiding from us. I still think she was trying to find out herself in the DPW who was selling these dinosaurs. Maybe she was trying to do it from the inside so it looks a little sketchy, but I think she was doing the right thing and trying to bring it down. Again, it's over? <laughs> I feel like that one went by extremely quick. But yeah, I don't think Brooklyn is did anything bad. I think she, I think she was just trying to take the DPW down or whoever is selling these dinosaurs. She's investigating that, she's trying to take him down. And then maybe she was found out or clearly she was found out and then they try to off her. I don't know what else to say. It's just weird not talking at the end. Thank you guys for watching this with me. Bye.